Okay, it took a while, but we finally got her down. Identified a few dents we need to address, but right now we'll go ahead and put it in an epoxy primer and then we'll start the bodywork process. Okay, here we are mixing up our epoxy primer. We're using some PPG epoxy 908. Uh, it mixes one to one with the epoxy 901 catalyst. So always use your mixing cups. They make it easy. We're gonna go ahead and mix a full cup here. So we've poured up to six with our epoxy. We'll go ahead and pour the corresponding amount of the catalyst on up to six. Mix it up, ready to go. Time to go ahead and apply some glazing putty to some of the lighter dings. And then we went ahead and put some actual body filler on the bigger dent that we had out front. It's time to go ahead and move on to a high build primer, a 2K primer. This is the uh, PPG shop line, JP202. Mixes four to one with the shop line JH302. To put it on, we'll go again with the air guns. This has the 1.8 tip and the high build primers is where this particular gun really works well. It puts a lot of material out. The high build's gonna be just a little bit thicker than a base coat or anything like that. It's a great primer gun. It's what it's designed for. Always use a filter, even if it looks clean. You can see in here, what the filter caught that would have went right into your gun. Well, we're probably to the point where we can kind of start to see some actual progress. We're ready to start block sanding the hood today. It's cured for weeks now since we put uh, three, three good coats of high build primer on it. Got some new stuff to try out on the project. Got a shipment in from Big Kid Blocks. They're polycarbonate blocks. And uh, pretty excited about them, actually. I've used Dura Blocks for a long time. And give these a shot. Got different ones, different flex. Polycarbonate's kind of the kind of the new norm for this, this stuff. And then also picked up some of their uh, Indasa paper. Give that a shot. I've tried the Amazon stuff. You can make it work. Not great. 3M does work, it's good. Let's give this Indasa a shot. Anyways, let's get started blocking this, see if we can get some paint on today. across with the 180 grit and it, it blocked out pretty well. There was one spot over here I added a little, another little shot of primer to. Going back for round two, another layer of guide coat and we'll start with the 220 here. Got the PPG shop line, Victory Red, it's gonna look awesome. It calls for a one-to-one -one mix with the reducer. And so we've poured up to the three on our one-to-one -one measure here. Time to pour up to the three with our second part, which is the reducer. Stir it up, get started. On this one, we'll be spraying with the Sada Jet 4000B, the 1.3 tip on about 24 PSI. So here we are after the last coat of clear. Everything turned out pretty well. Should look pretty decent, especially after we buff it. <laughs> 